What are you doing? You ready to give off some good information? Yep, in my slippers. <laughs> All right, what are we talking about today? Um, as promised, process to buying the truck. Process of buying a truck. Skeezy on the beat, oh. All right, so what's the first process to buying a truck? What, what's the first process? Well, first you have to decide where you're gonna buy from because there's definitely plenty of places. Um, as most of you know, we originally Excuse were renting me. from riders, so we figured we're renting from them, why not buy from them? And right. So that's what we went with, and at the time, what month was it, maybe like March or April? Yeah, we, we was in business for like a month. At the time? A and month and a half, month and a half. We were like, let's just look into buying, and Ryder was, uh, advertising zero percent down so we were like shit okay all right so we went through the whole process with them they took all of our information bank statements credit everything uh, and they came back and they were like hey um 30 percent down we got you and we were and we was like we was like what i was like what do you mean like you're literally advertising zero percent down she was like oh no um that's only if you've been in business with us for uh like two years and i was like okay um so you just ran our credit knowing that we were anticipating zero percent yeah so we had we had to be renting from them we had to be renting from them for two years right and i was like lady zero percent down because nobody's saving anything for two years got it yeah we got don't it. by the time you by the time you don't rent that truck you don't pay for i think i think like five of them right like or at least something like that no four i think like four I think it's like four. So, so scratch that. Did not. Did, did not go, do didn't it. go with that one. All right. All right. So so step one. Um. So we decided on a truck with Penske. We looked and they had like a bunch of them listed in Mebbin. So we went up there. We went to go check them out. Head fake. Um. All the ones listed actually weren't there. They were being rented at the time. So they said we could either. What did they say? We could either. We could buy one sight unseen. Buy, yeah, sight unseen. Ain't no, nobody trying to buy no truck and not even see it. Like, right. Nah, cuz. Um, or they could coordinate with the person renting it to bring it back for you to look at it. And I was like, sorry to laugh in your face, but um, <laughs> no, that nobody's going to do that. All right, so we were there and they didn't have any trucks. So they called the Raleigh office and they sent us over there to check one out. So that's what we did. Um, ended up being the truck that we got. And so they said that we needed to put a deposit down and um, to secure the truck. So any truck that you decide that you want, you have to put down a thousand dollar deposit um, in order for them to like take it off of the website. And that thousand dollar deposit goes to the, the big yeah. deposit for your finance. Yeah, finance for your down company. payment. So on September 16th, we put down our deposit and then um, that set everything in motion. So then we were just waiting for the bill of sale. So bill of sale was officially completed on the 28th so that's when we were told exactly what our deposit or our down payment would be um which was six thousand dollars so a thousand dollars for the de um deposit and then six thousand dollars total was the down payment um what was it the wire so in order to do your uh deposit for the thousand dollars you can use credit card or debit card or whatever um, but when you're actually ready for your down payment, it can only be wire and cashier's check. Yeah, cashier's check. Yeah. Cashier's check takes five days uh, after they process it. And then the wire only takes two days, two business days. So five business days versus two business days. So that's why we went with the wire because it was faster. Right. So October 5th is when we did the wire deposit. And that same day we changed over our insurance. Insurance didn't cost us anything else that day. Um, but our insurance did go up from... Like eight hundred and it went from yeah. five thirty two to eight sixty two. Sixty something, yeah. So only up like three hundred dollars. Um, they let us know on the seventh, so two days later that the truck was ready. Uh, but that was it was like late on a Friday, so and we had to go all the way to Mebbin to go get it. So we ended up actually picking it up on Tuesday the eleventh. <clears throat> With um, no tags. Yeah, yeah. With no tags. So um, so there was something that I was thinking about that is so with Penske, you get that 15 day warranty from the time that you pick up the truck. So what I was thinking in my head, I was like, dang. So if we were, if you was to get your tags, have your tags, get your bill late and just let the truck sit at Penske 
until you get everything where you need it to be and then go pick it up so that way you can you know book your first load as soon as you get it you can test drive your truck you can run your truck out for 15 days and see how it runs and what you like about it what you don't like about it and see if something break on it then you can turn it back in that 15 days so we ended up only having like probably like five to six extra days from the time we from the time that we room. actually picked it up because we couldn't really we picked the truck up just to put it in the store so it wouldn't move so right. Um, so we picked it up on the 11th and like he was saying through Penske, they don't do your tags, your registration, your, even your sales tax. We were not prepared for that. Um, they don't really do anything. They don't care if you drive it off the lot with nothing, but they also don't do anything. So that was quite the process. Um, so picked it up on the 11th and then you have to wait for the title to be delivered to the, your choice, uh, driver's license office or what is it tag office tag office yeah. yeah license place agency um so you have to wait for that to be delivered they'll contact you and ask you like where you want it sent and everything and then you just have to wait they give you like a fedex tracking number um but you have to wait so that took eight days it was delivered on the 19th um so oh. all right so the 19th was the um license plate office where we got the registration and so for registration we also had to pay the sales tax like i said we weren't prepared for that one um but that was the two thousand two hundred dollars um and then that same office couldn't do the tag so we had to go to a separate office to do that yeah, it was at the wrong place we gotta go to, you gotta go you don't go to a regular license place place you go to the actual i i r p a or something something like that yeah um, and then he got there and realized that he needed a DOT inspection. So we had to go get a DOT inspection, um, and that cost $109. And no, they wouldn't transfer the DOT inspection from the other one that was already up there. They wouldn't do it because it wasn't in our name, and the DOT inspection wasn't under our name. Like our It wasn't business, pulling yeah. up under our name. So. Yeah. Um, so not optional. So then the, that was on the 20th and then the 21st, we finally got the tags. So tags, you have to pay property tax and tags. And that was $775. So that's what. So all together, what we spent to get this truck in our actual possession was a grand total of whopping. $9,084. So we ended up paying $9,084 with only a 10% our, our um, down payment was only 10% of the truck. So right. truck so. 65. Yeah, the truck was 65,000. 2017. Yeah. And then it, we it added had on the warranty. On it, something like that. And then keep in mind, so they do the sales tax based off of your bill of sale. So your bill of sale also includes the warranty that you choose. So the sales tax was based off of everything combined. So it was based off of like the $72,000 since we had an added warranty. Mm -hmm. So that's so, the process. Roughly about, 10, roughly about 10 bands we spent just to get this truck. And we still ain't got it rolling yet because the lift gate was messed up. So we had to use the warranty for the lift gate, which you guys will probably see in the next video. So... I it's think. been a process. Maybe. It's been it's a process. Been a very been a process. stressful process. So, that was the process, guys. If y'all got any questions, y'all know what to do. Drop it down in the comments. We'll do our best to get back to anybody in the comment section. You know what I'm saying? If we don't get back to you, sorry. You feel me? But, <laughs> you know, you know how it is when it's truck mother trucking out here. You know? All right? So... Peace, love, and happiness. Till next time, we out. <laughs>